and he asked her what she wanted to eat. Sis said a salad. Girl, you better get a steak or something. No como carne. Oh, she don't eat meat. Okay, sis, I'm sorry. <laughs> Hello, so it is Friday and I'm going to do some discussion posts today. I'm going to do a protein treatment on my hair and then I'm going to study for my anatomy exam. I have, uh, I washed my hair yesterday, I put a deep conditioner in it last night and then I rinsed out the deep conditioner this morning and I just think it's time for another protein treatment. I haven't done one in a little while, so that's the agenda for today. I'm gonna knock out these freaking discussion responses. Goodness. finished it is only it only took me like maybe an, maybe not even an hour to do my responses um, I like to keep them short and simple throw in a little citation and then keep it pushing so tomorrow I have to do my last couple of responses and that'll be it for my discussion pose I don't think I'm gonna re uh, record for Saturday and Sunday simply because well for starters Another rule I forgot to mention is that Saturdays are like my my me time days. Like I have one day out of the week where I'm not doing as much schoolwork and I'm just chilling. So yeah, but I mean, I'm going to have to do stuff because I have a test so I'm going to be studying. But in general, Saturdays are like my days to just chill. So yeah, now I'm going to go to Sally's pick up a protein treatment and do my hair. This is what my hair is looking like. It's damp because I had it in a t-shirt. Um, in general, it's not like you see how it still stays a little bit stretched. That's how you can tell if you need protein. But because my hair is high porosity, I'm using pro. I need to do. I'm blah. I'm doing a protein treatment. Um, my hair is not naturally high pro high porosity, which is why I am so adamant about doing one. I need to do them more often. I need to wash my hair more often. But this is a lot of work, so I just like to keep it in like twists or something, and then call it a day. Quick little length check, though. And then my hair in the back, it is almost at my collarbone, which is where it was when I cut it in November. This side is shorter because, you know, I cut it myself, so it's a little uneven. But this side also almost goes to my collarbone, which is where it was when I cut it. So I think my, my hair grew back about an inch so far since November so yeah that's pretty good pretty good and then my side pieces side piece <laughs> my side pieces are about the same so yeah so I'm gonna grow I think I'm gonna just protective style this year and before I start straightening my hair again um because my hair is very sensitive to heat so I'm gonna let it chill for this year and then really grow it out before I go back to straightening it. Cause I like wearing my hair straight. It looks pretty. All right, I'm back and I'm trying to stop watching YouTube videos as much. So something I've been doing the past time is I'll practice Spanish on Duolingo. Uh, so this is what I'm gonna start doing as like a time filler. Tu compras. Oh, na casa. Did you buy a house? I think that's what that means. Una casa. Yeah. Here's the Afogee protein um, treatment that I'm going to be using. It's the two-step 
if it would focus. Come on. Stop doing me like that. So I'll be doing that later on. But in the meantime, I'll be studying and practicing Spanish. They have this option called Stories where you can watch a story play out. So this is Maria and I forgot what his name is, but they're married and she has a English test, but she can't find her English book. And he's like, Maria, tu libro está aquí en la mesa. It's over here on the table. Sis, come on now. You ain't even looking hard enough. Perdón, mi amor. Estoy cansada. Oh, I'm sorry, my love. I forgot. Oh, I'm tired. I didn't know. I didn't know what cansada meant. But yeah, this is really cool. Just learning what dialogue looks like. So I highly recommend that you use Duolingo both on your phone app and on the computer. Okay, now I'm on another one. And Julia is on a date. And he asked her what she wanted to eat. Sis said a salad. Girl, you better get a steak or something. No como carne. Oh, she don't eat meat. Okay, sis, I'm sorry. Eres vegetariana? Si. Oh, she's a vegetarian. Oh, he is too. Oh, look, this is a match made in heaven. Go ahead, sis. He's also a vegetarian. See, look, guys, I, I definitely think y'all should get Duolingo because this is, and this is not even sponsored. This is just so entertaining. Oh, my goodness. De donde eres? Where are you from? Oops. Soy americano. Oh, he's American. Nice. Mi padre es de Cuba y mi madre es de México. His father is from Cuba and his mom is from Mexico. Yo soy cubana. Oh, she's Cuban. Cuba es muy bonita. Oh, it's a beautiful country. Mascotas. Mascotas. What does that mean? Pets. Tengo tres gatos y dos perros. Oh, she got three cats and two perros. Perros, two dogs. Qué interesante. Mm, how interesting. Yo también tengo dos perros, Gabriela. Oh, she, he also has two. Wait, her name is Gabriela? I thought her name was Julia. Eh? Soy Julia. Yeah. Girl. Tú eres José, ¿verdad? Oh, look, they on the wrong date. Ay, no. Mi nombre es Daniel. Bruh, she trying to be on a date with Jose. He looking for Gabriella. Tragic. Una mujer camina hacia Daniel. What the heck does that even mean? Walks toward. Oh, a woman walks toward Daniel. Hola. It's gonna go Daniel? down. Soy Gabriela. Dang. No, lo siento. Soy Jose. Now he lying, I'm dead. <laughs> Bro, y'all should definitely, definitely get this. Okay, so real quick before I go, I'm just gonna show you how I plan on studying over the weekend. So since there's been three weeks that passed, I'm going to go through, I guess today I'll go through one and then tomorrow I'll go through two. So um, for each week, there are lectures that we can watch. So I'm going to go through one or two of these lectures. They're usually um, related in some way. And then go through the PowerPoints as I watch these lectures, just so that I can get a visual and like a summary form of what I read in the book. Um, it's kind of like kind of like listening to a podcast in a way while you go through your PowerPoint. So I'm going to do that for each week um, that has passed so far. So there's three weeks worth of lectures and PowerPoints. And yeah, very, I don't know, very relaxed, very chill. Um, so I'm not going to film that because it's going to be really boring to see me studying over the weekend. But with that being said, that concludes this week in my life get a little glimpse of what i go through on a day-to-day -day basis i still get to do stuff that i want to do during the day but i always make sure that i am taking care of stuff that needs to be done and i'm not always getting my stuff done the way i planned it but i'm getting it done regardless if that makes sense and i'm learning not to beat myself up over stuff like that because as long as it gets done and i do a good job who cares if I did it on Wednesday instead of Tuesday? 
Um, I also, um, if you watch my first video, you'll see that I plan things in a way so that if I am running behind, um, I have cushion, like I have extra time to get it done. For example, I plan to turn something in on Tuesday and it's due on Wednesday, but I'm running behind, so I'm gonna have to finish the assignment on Wednesday and then turn it in. That's perfectly fine because it's due on Wednesday anyways. Doing it on Tuesday would just make, mean that I turn it in early, but if I do it on Wednesday, I'm still doing it on time, if that makes sense. That's how I have my planner designed. <laughs> yeah, thank you guys so much for watching. Don't forget to check out the playlist with the rest of the videos if you missed anything. And now I'm gonna go, I'm going to be going back to my once or twice a week uploads. This was just kind of like a spur of the moment thing. I really wasn't planning on doing a video each day of the week, but I'm proud of myself for doing it. Cause yeah, it's a lot, <laughs> but yeah. But I'm going to stop rambling, like this video, subscribe if you aren't already, and I will see you guys next week.